Hi everyone, Savannah Tree Foundation Field Manager Jake Henry here and today I wanted to do a quick tree species video. I'm pretty sure I've done this one before but it's just worthy of multiple videos. Uh, this is our calorie pear or Pyrus calariana. Uh, the most notable cultivar is the Bradford pear uh, which has become incredibly invasive over the years uh, and is no longer planted at least intentionally. Um, now this is a really interesting tree species because of its branch architecture. So uh, when I say branch architecture, essentially I mean the way that the branches actually angle off of the tree. Species can actually vary quite a bit based on their branch angle. So a good comparison would be say a uh, southern magnolia. So we've got one here across the street and you can see that branch comes out almost at a right angle. That's pretty much straight out. Whereas the calorie pears are very upright, very uh, small branch angle in between the main trunk and the branch. Um, now this is uh, not necessarily a good thing. So one of the pros is you get a nice uh, dense canopy, so there's a lot of great shade here for all these cars. Uh, but one of the problems that you end up with is that these branches start to run into each other. So let's see if we can find one here where they're starting to run into each other. And these trees are actually very well maintained, so kudos to the city of Savannah uh, for taking care of these because Bradford pears are a lot of work. Um, we can see a couple dead branches here. It looks like they've been pruned off and one of them broke there. Um, so essentially what happens is because of these sharp branch angles, uh, the branches start to run into each other. They start to grow together and you'll end up with, with what's called included bark. And essentially that is uh, an area where two branches or a limb and the trunk are growing together and they're sort of fighting for space. And so you'll end up with disease, weakened wood, uh, really just poor structure in that area and that happens a lot with the calorie pear and You don't actually see a whole lot on these branches um, Like I said the city's doing a great job, but you can see on most of these trees here lots of pruning cuts um, So we've got one right there One right there one right there another one there that's healed up another one here So <laughs> there are a lot of work to keep them healthy uh, and if, you, if you're willing to put in the effort, prune them regularly, um, you can end up with a nice sort of upright shade tree like this. Um, but if you don't take care of it, you'll end up with a lot of dead limbs, and especially here where there's lots of parking, we don't want those falling on cars, obviously. So uh, they can be a lot of work to maintain, but if you take care of them, they're not so bad. Um, however, such as the Bradford Pear cultivar, incredibly invasive. We don't want those out in natural areas. So in terms of retaining them, not so bad, uh, but we really don't want to encourage planting more of these tree species here if we don't have to. Thank you all so much for watching and stay tuned for more videos. Take care.